Ball played into the box, so you have to be careful here because you see he's starting to look dangerous. Shot comes in, that could have gone anywhere. Shot from uh, Adam Ferdinand. And as we hear the applause growing, and that is for Cork City fan Alton Crowley Clayton, who passed away at a very young age, very, very recently. All of us here at Cork City FC extend all of our sympathies to Alton's family. There's a GoFundMe as well on the club sources you can check out. Rest in peace, Alton. City till I die and beyond. Coffee. That's a, the right back, Kostovic, who's got a bargain with the company. Plays it to Bargary. It's Warman who's popping up everywhere. He's going to shoot his left foot. He is. He's going to take that shot. Oh, that is a fine effort good. from Cork City's number 16, Ben Warman. And that is a good save from Lorcan Healy. We talked about the potential for Warman to be dangerous. And he showed his uh, class there, Philip Long. He did, of course. He brought it in, came inside onto his favourite left foot. Just abided his time, came in another little bit and just let it fly. He's unlucky, just I don't think he got enough of power out of it, to be honest with you, Rory, but he's still, he's still on target. The students growing like Arthur Sarah turns cross. Brendan Barr just kind of crowded out, but still gets the ball to Derek Keane. This, is dangerous. this is dangerous here for Cork City. As they win the ball back and it's Bargery. That's a fine ball from Coffey to release Bargery, the tip man, on his bike here. Look at Kostovic, he's on the underlap here, now he's on the overlap. Kostovic is in here. Plays it back to Bargary, takes a shot, oh. and that is just over the bar from Kean Bargary. Oh, that was a big chance, a big that, chance. That was a fine free-flowing yeah. move from the Rebel Army. For it the was, block. it was a great move. Bargary coming away, and he knows See. he missed that. He it's knows he missed that, yeah. Talking it's a great, great one. Great move. He caught inside. I thought, actually, you know, it, I wasn't expecting him to get the ball back to him. I think no, but it was great, expecting the ball played across the goal. across the goal, yeah, yeah. And nine times out of ten, that's what would have happened. But a fine move yeah. for Corey That was all started off by a terrific it's ball. Like, Bodger goes ball. forward. Kibi is still out left. Bodger goes to him. Back to Warman. Warman his left foot, tries to play that ball in. Oh. Drops, shoots, oh. and that's in! Oh, God, what goes a goal. Goes to City. Oh, what a goal. Through his legs. Ian Bargary puts Cork City ahead after 26 minutes here at Turner's Cross. Cork City won. You see the nil. Larkin Healy won't be happy with that goal. And he certainly won't be, Phil. City fans celebrate. Ian Bargary celebrates. That's his first goal of the season. Boy, is he enjoying it. So watch a good work from Kabia. And you know, Gorman just Gorman hits it in. There's no one in the box as such. Kabia is outside and just went right underneath his legs. Cork City caught the ball oh. again. Dryman. Brendan Barr. Goes past, he goes past Brendan Barr. That's a lovely ball across. Great ball across. Just a little bit ahead of Bargary. Kostovic takes his first time and that's oh. a hitter. Coffee was unlucky. From Barry Coffee. Cork City looking threatening again. Certainly knocking at uh, Lorcan Healy's goal, Phil. Yes, they're certainly pushing it around now. They're, they're starting to find gaps. They need another one before half time, Rory. Ball just played across there. You see yeah. it there, Barry just couldn't Barbary get a just unlucky. Drops to Kostovic, who plays the ball in. Great first time ball in. Great oh, ball over the top. Great ball. Kabir, who's onside. Yeah. Oh. Tries to go back on his left foot. He plays it all the way across. Too, oh, too shot. casual. Too casual. Just unlucky. Nice football from Cork City. Yeah. As Kabir played it to Bargu, who played it to Coffey, who got the Came ball. on to a lovely. Caught under his feet a little yes. bit. As we look at it yeah. here again. Yeah. And yeah. Just Great couldn't ball. get any power or direction in his effort. Great turn by Kabir. He's yeah. working, as I said, working Lovely there. touch. Look. Oh, he just tried to place the ball instead of driven it. Maybe he should put his leg out Higgins. He looks up. Goes back to Gallagher. And Gallagher goes forward. Norris. Norris plays a lovely ball in, and it's there. It's the equalising goal. Cork and City 1, UCD 1. Shouts for offside. Nah, they deserve it, Rory. They deserve it. Just before that cross came across. He walked in between four players. Bishop. Tanu Kinsley Bishop on as a substitute as the UCD fans go wild away in the St. Anne's end. 
And that was a lovely ball. Lovely ball in. in. Look, no one there. Daniel Kinsley Bishop just completely unmarked for Completely unmarked. It's still on a pitch level. Burden plays that in. Oh, Keating, Keating again. wins the header. Now carry Whoa. it, carry it. He's got Bagri ahead of him. Keating is sprinting to get back into it. Warm and the ball just oh, he just sticked on his toe. Keating, is he going to take a shot here? He is. He's oh, taking deflection. a deflection corner. <coughs> Better from Cork City, fell. Yes. Great run yeah. by Ben Warman, who we, has been impressive here. Yeah, he is a quality uh, player, to be honest. Debut. And he's not, he's not afraid to have a shot, which is great. See, Phil, the ball just kind of just got a little yeah, bit ahead of him when he had Bagri outside yeah, him. Yeah. It's coming out to the corner, out to the penalty spot. Oops. Oh. There's a UCD player down, down. on his face. It's been marked by Rory Keating. He's still down. Rory, sh Rory Keating should go away from there now. But Keating is telling him to get up. Not happy with it at all. Yeah. Nothing in it from what I could see. Yeah. Might see a replay now if he can. What's the replay here? It's just yeah. Daniel Norris. Quick Rory Keating. Just as the ball comes in. Keating just a little push off. Push off, yeah. yeah. That's one. Again opening up. He's got room here to shoot him. Is he going to take the option? He is. Oh. Took it too late, Phil. No, it's coffee. That's coffee with the shot. Oh! Over the bar. Warman has to be shooting earlier there, Phil. Yeah, it looked as if he was going to. He just Four got blocked minutes down. to be added on. Minimum of four minutes. Four minutes out of time. Four minutes. Now, UCD, can they get a winner here? It's Brennan. He's been brilliant. Oh, this, oh. Warming up for a shot for Brennan, perhaps. He's running out of space. Shoots on the left oh. and forces a save from Ali Byrne. The time he had on the ball, it's, it's so much time. That looked like he was going to creep in for Yeah. Good save by Ali Byrne. Look He's at the time. No, no, Coleman tried to go out and there's no one came out after him. Cuts back inside. He played the four. All eyes now on Gavin Colfer. Brennan, who's been a bright spot for UCD. Gavin Colfer about to put the, the whistle to his lips, you'd imagine. That's it. And that is that. Booze around Turner's Cross as Cork City and UCD play out a one-all draw here in their SSC, their Tracy League First Division clash. It was Aaron Bodger put City ahead in the first half as his shot went through the hands of Lorcan Healy. Substitute Danu Kinsley Bishop equalised for UCD, so the students uh, take a deserved point back. Up to Dublin with them, they were excellent in the second half. City would be ruining their dominance in the first half, and they couldn't cr transfer that dominance into goals. Cork City players here look upset. The atmosphere here is dead. It's finished. Cork City won. UCD won here at Turner's Cross.